Hi there, welcome to Practice Better, and thank you for joining us for this demo. We're going to walk you through some of the key features of the platform. When you first sign into your portal, you'll be taken to your practitioner dashboard like this. It is also known as your homepage. Here you have different widgets that you can organize. At a glance, you can view your upcoming client sessions, pending tasks, and new client journal entries available for you to review. Navigate up to the gear icon in the top right hand corner. Here you'll find your settings and preferences to personalize your account to your needs. To set up your profile, go to My Practice, My Profile. Here you can add your biography, your accreditations, and link to your social media. Under the Company Profile tab, you can add your clinic locations and company details. To add a form or waiver, go to My Practice, Form and Waivers. Click on the red Fast Action button in the bottom right hand corner. This button shows you the actions associated with the page. You will see this button throughout the platform. When you click on this button, you'll be prompted to create a new form or waiver from scratch, upload a form from your computer's hard drive. Keep in mind, if you're uploading an external form to practice better, your clients will not be able to complete it within the portal. And lastly, you have the ability to create a form or waiver using one of the available templates. You can use the templates as is or customize it to fit your needs. Once you set up your form, you can map your form responses to sections within the client record, the basic information, medical history, and diet and lifestyle sections. This allows you to import important information from your client's completed forms to their client record. Now that you set up your forms, you can go ahead and set up the services you'd like to offer by going to My Practice, My Services. Let's take a look at a service already created. When setting up your service, you can include a description, set the duration and fee, if you've integrated your account with Stripe or Square, you can collect payment at the time of booking and collect credit card information. Under service availability, you can set how you'd like your service to be available, whether that's in person, by phone, or through online slash video chat. Within Practice Better, you can use telehealth or integrate your account with Zoom. Under booking options, you can include buffer times before or after your session, or even restrict how soon in advance a client can request a session with you. Once you've set up your services, you can bundle them within a package. If you plan on running a program within Practice Better, you also have the ability to add a program within your package. As part of your services, packages, and programs, you have the ability to add payment plan options for your clients. You can set the deposit and installment payment you wish to collect and the frequency in which you'd like to collect the installment payment. In addition, you can add forms to your services, packages, and programs, so clients will need to complete that form or waiver as part of their booking process. Next, once you have at least one service created, you can set up when you'd like your clients to be able to book with you. Go to My Practice, My Availability. To add a time slot, you can either drag or drop the times you wish to be available, or click on the Fast Action button and manually enter in the start and end time. When setting up your availability, you can restrict how you want your services to be conducted. For example, if you offer your service in more than one method, you can restrict that within your availability. If you're working at a more than one location, you also have the ability to restrict which location you will be available at at that time. The Practice Better availability is great for practitioners whose availability varies day by day or for those whose availability reoccurs. Once you set up your availability, you can view your book sessions and events by going to My Calendar. 
If you have a Google Calendar linked to your Practice Better account, you will see your external events here. By default, clients won't be able to book sessions with you that conflict with the events scheduled in your Google Calendar, and no client will have access to view your calendar events and bookings. Moving on to programs, to create a program, go to My Practice, My Programs. On the Pro Plan, you can create a fixed date program, and on the Plus Plan, you can create both fixed date and an evergreen program. A fixed date program, as the name suggests, is for a fixed period of time. Clients will enter in the program together and receive content at the same time. An evergreen program can be run like an e-course and allow the client to run through the program on their own. You can have multiple clients in the program at different stages. Content and modules are released according to when your client enrolls, for example, days or weeks after enrollment. Within each program module, you can add text, upload photos, MP3 links, videos, add external documents such as handouts, recipe guides, or meal plans, and create tasks in association with each module. We know the many hats you wear, we want to alleviate some of your load. Under My Practice, automations. You'll see the available automations for you to use. Automations allow you to completely automate your client onboarding process. We allow you to set up automations such as adding new clients to practice better, adding tags to clients based on services booked, confirming bookings, sending forms automatically before or after sessions, and more. Now let's take a look at working with clients. You can view your clients by going to My Clients in the top left-hand corner. When adding a client to Practice Better, you can choose to give them access to the platform or create a profile only for them. Keep in mind, clients without access to the platform can still complete forms, tasks, pay invoices, and request a session. You can organize your clients by assigning tags to them and using the tags as searches. At the top of your page, you'll see a magnifying glass, which will allow you to search for a client from any page. Now let's take a look at Mary Smith's client record. You can organize the client's record with different widgets available. Under Recent Activity, you can see all the recent activity your client has made and all notifications sent and delivered to your client. For example, if you send your client a form, you can verify that the email was delivered to the email on file. This allows you to assist your clients better if they're having troubles locating resources sent to them. Within a client's record, you can easily see all information regarding this client, see their upcoming sessions, any pending booking requests, any tasks. On the left-hand side, you could enter different sections within the client record. You can review or take chart notes. You can create protocols for your clients and much more. If you typically follow a certain flow for your clients, you can create no templates from scratch or from our available templates to save yourself time. Within the note templates, you can add placeholders so that specific information from the client file goes into the session note automatically. Here's what it's like to create a note for Mary Smith. Here's an example of a note already created. By default, notes are private but you can share certain sections of your note with your clients by enabling this toggle and selecting share notes and attach documents with my client. You also have the ability to sign your notes. You may notice that you make the same recommendations over and over again. You can use protocol templates to create templates for your food, supplement, and lifestyle recommendations. Here's an example of a protocol created for Mary Smith.
If you're in the US or Canada, you can also link a Fullscript account to Practice Better, so you can search their supplement catalog directly. Once you've created a protocol for your client, a supplement chart will be automatically generated. Now, let's take a look at billing and payments. Here, you also have the ability to create super bills and CMS 1500 forms if you or your clients accept insurance. To collect payment through Practice Better, connect your account with either Stripe or Square. All your invoices and receipts are automatically stored in Practice Better and can be exported to CSV files. You can filter your invoices according to unpaid, partially paid, and paid. When creating an invoice, you can create an invoice directly from scratch or from a service already booked. Here's an example of an invoice already made. If your client already has a credit card on file, select process to collect payment and send a receipt to your client. Or select send to send the invoice to your client in which they'll be prompted to make payment by entering in their credit card details. If you're collecting payment outside of Practice Better, select the record a payment option to record payments collected outside of the platform. Once done, select send to send your client and receipt for this invoice. Now let's talk about team plan. If you're on the plus plan, you have the option of adding up to three admin to your account who will have their own unique login. If you're on our team plan, you have the ability to add other practitioners under the same account. Practice owners are able to set roles and permissions on a very granular level for each user. The admin functionality is great for virtual assistants, staff members, such as receptionists as well. You can provide them with access to only certain sections of your platform or the entire platform, depending on what their daily tasks will be. If you have the team plan, you have the option to collaborate and share resources such as forms, programs, note templates, services, and packages. If your team member's calendar is visible to you, you can see their schedule as well. With the team plan, you can make an individualized booking page or a booking page for your entire team. This will allow clients to choose which practitioner they want to see for their service, or clients can choose the service and then choose which practitioner they'd like to work with. Now let's take a quick look at the client portal. From the home page, clients will see any outstanding forms that they have pending. They will see their progress in any programs that they're enrolled in. They can see any tasks assigned to them, their upcoming sessions. If they have a telehealth session booked, they can enter the session by clicking on the telehealth icon. If your client has a package, they can book sessions from their package directly from the client portal request a session button. If your client has access to the secure chat, they can click on the chat at the bottom of the page to send you a message. For clients using journals, they can create a food and mood journal or lifestyle journal here. Within the food and mood journal, clients can track their water and food intake by searching a food database writing in their own words what they've consumed or by taking a photo of their meal. Clients can see a nutritional breakdown of the foods they've consumed when using the food database. This is optional and can be turned off on a client-to-client -client basis from your practitioner account. Clients with access to the client portal also have access to all resources that you've shared with them including session notes, documents, programs, receipts, protocols, and much more. This can be located under My Resources. 
Thank you for taking the time to watch this demo of Practice Better. If you have any questions at all, please don't hesitate to contact us at help at practicebetter.io.